Herman Cain, a successful businessman who ran for the 2012 Republican presidential nomination and later became a backer of President Donald Trump, has died from complications from COVID-19. He was 74. We knew when he was first hospitalized with COVID-19 that this was going to be a rough fight. He had trouble breathing and was taken to the hospital by ambulance. We all prayed that the initial meds they gave him would get his breathing back to normal, but it became clear pretty quickly that he was in for a battle. Kane, who survived a battle with stage 4 colon cancer, had been pretty healthy in recent years but was considered to be in a high-risk group for COVID-19 complications due to his history with cancer. Last month, Kane had tested positive for COVID-19, just a little over a week after he had attended a Trump campaign rally in Tulsa, Oklahoma on June 20. While there's no way to pinpoint exactly where he contracted the virus, Kane posted a photo of himself with others at the event, which showed him without a mask on. More than 150,000 people in the, the United States have died from COVID-19. Kane tested positive on June 29. A statement posted to his official Twitter account days later said that Kane had developed symptoms serious enough that he required hospitalization at an Atlanta area hospital. Kane, who is an official surrogate for Trump's 2020 re-election campaign, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Click the bell to get notification when we drop our next video.